My brothers, my sisters, face the reality. We have been emotionally trapped at times because of the mobile device. We see things that do not exist. We see people that are not real. We see things that are not the way they are. When you look at someone, you fall in love with someone online. Ask yourself, what is it that I have fallen in love with? You might think, well, it's the deen and the akhlaq. Right? We always say, إِذَا أَتَاكُمْ مَنْ تَرْضَوْنَ دِينَهُ وَخُلُقَهُ فَزَوِّجُوهُ If someone comes to you and their deen is satisfactory, which means their connection with Allah and their level of character and conduct is satisfactory, then allow the marriage. If both parties would like to get married, boy and girl, the, the, the bride and groom are both interested in each other, let it be because the deen is okay, the akhlaq is okay. But hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Do you know the norms and traditions and the cultures that you've been brought up within actually do play a role to a degree in whether or not your marriage is going to be prosperous? And that's why if you're a very cultural person and your broader family is extremely cultured to a specific culture, you probably wouldn't even be able to eat the food of the person you're trying to get married to simply because they love something totally different.